take many more of those. Come fight night, I don't want him throwing in the towel. So after a day's rest, I've decided to see how he copes in the ultimate test of stamina. A conveyor belt of fresh spine partners known as the Shark Tank. There you go. Just look for your shots, that's it. Every minute, he faces a fresh opponent. Once he gets to that wall, you can go through that wall. You can push yourself even more. It's gonna feel like hell, He's got to understand, he's got to keep going. He's got to keep pushing. Time, time. Nice work. Six bouts later, Idris is still standing. There was opportunities where you're like, I could. And that's the important thing, you're seeing gaps now. You never saw them before, you just threw for the sake of it. For sure. Best mate Warren, himself a former champion Thai boxer, has been scouting for a suitable opponent. We, we want this to be a real fight, you know, as fair as possible. What weight is Lionel, do you know, around? Uh, it's, uh, it's around 90, 90, 92 kilos. Hey! He's picked one of the most experienced fighters in Mike's gym, hey! Lionel Graves. Fight, fight, fight. Lionel has been fighting as a pro for 16 years. With 10 fights and only two defeats on his record, he has far more experience than Idris, and he's much younger. Only 32. I think this is going to be the fight of my life. Before the fight takes place, the European president of the International Sport Kickboxing Association must judge whether the two fighters are a good match. Push it, push it, I mean, push people it. might claim that it's not a real fight. Um, I wouldn't be here if it's not a real fight because I'm staking my reputation on this. I'm a president of a credible organization. It's going to be a great fight, but it's definitely going to be real. You could feel the tension in the room. Lionel looked confident but you shouldn't underestimate Idris. That's a dangerous thing to do. As far as I was concerned, he was just a bag and I was gonna hit him. But then when I looked in his eyes, I saw another guy, another bloke. And I thought to myself, you know what? I can actually beat this guy. Idris could be about to suffer the biggest humiliation of his life in front of a capacity crowd of 1,200 and the world's press. I just need to remember to keep calm. If I can do that, I might be in with a chance. to get here. I'm just ready to fight, man. Just give it my all. Lionel came out, all guns blazing. I was worried for Idris. Halfway through the first round, and Elba is way behind on points. And a right hook to the face again. Elba won't be able to take many more of those. Elba fights back. But he's got to watch those legs. He just was hurt by low kicks. He was getting caught with some big knees and some big punches. Elba has got to stay focused. He can't allow Graves to break him. Frustrated, Graves just won't give him room to work as he applies the pressure. Oh. 